Degenerative or age-related changes in our bodies can lead to compression of the nerves or pressure on the nerves that may cause pain and or damage. Advanced degenerative disc disease may cause lumbar spinal stenosis, which results from a gradual narrowing of the space where nerves pass through the spine and may be a result of aging and wear and tear on the spine from everyday activities and or positional changes of the vertebrae that occur as a result. Symptoms of lumbar spinal stenosis may include decreased endurance during physical exercise and activities, weakness and or loss of balance, numbness and a prickly feeling in your legs, calves, or buttocks, aching dull back pain spreading to your legs. Symptoms improve when you sit, lean forward, lie on your back, or sit with your feet raised. Neurogenic claudication. If you feel that you are experiencing any of these symptoms, you should see a physician for an accurate diagnosis. If lumbar spinal stenosis is established as a diagnosis, your doctor may recommend one or more of the following treatments based on your individual condition. Physical therapy and strengthening exercises, rest and a restriction of physical activity, injections of corticosteroids to help reduce the pain and swelling, medications and analgesics to reduce pain and swelling. Typical medications included non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. If your symptoms do not improve with other methods, your physician may suggest spinal surgery. Surgical solutions for lumbar spinal stenosis include decompression surgery, laminectomy, and decompression with fusion surgery. To learn more about lumbar spinal stenosis and nuvasive procedural solutions, please visit www.nuvasive.com.